Uh, Muhammad from Kuwait's first question was about his son. His son, like most of the new generation now, they are influenced greatly by hip hop singers, by uh, movies, by the Western culture, which is the new form of invasion. So he feels inferior, he feels weak, he doesn't know anything about Islam, he doesn't know probably except uh, Al-Fatiha maybe. And uh, if you tell him, do you know Ayat al-Kursi, he would not uh, uh, probably know it by heart. So how would he feel uh, the pride and the dignity among his peers is by doing something that no other one uh, would probably do. So he pierced his ear to wear an earring, and most likely it's one ear only, not both ears. Maybe next year he would do tattoos on his body, unfortunately. May Allah protect him and guide him. So uh, Muhammad is asking, is this permissible? And the answer is no. The Prophet wasallam cursed the men who imitate women and cursed the women who imitate men. And the Prophet told us those who imitate the disbelievers or those who, dis, uh, who imitate a people would be among them. So Muhammad, your son is one of two. Either he's imitating women or he's imitating kuffar. And I, I very much doubt that if you look at any of the scholars of Islam, of the da'is, of the judges, of the imams of the masjid, you would find anyone piercing his ear. No one does this except the kafir. And even the bad sinful Muslims don't do this generally speaking. So he is in great danger. He should repent to Allah Azza wa and stop what he's doing and to be proud of his Islam before it is soon without him realizing he may think of other religions to be better than Islam.